Hi, my name is O'Neill Ankle, principal at Jonathan Grand High School, right here in the old capital of Spanish Town, St. Catherine. And I want to share a few tips with my colleagues and friends as it relates to co-curricular activities during this time of COVID-19. Co-curricular activities form an important part of school development. It helps with the relationship building, it helps with how we, we, we operate as human beings and so we can take that out into the outside world. It means, therefore, that we should not stop co-curricular activities even during this pandemic. So I want to share a few tips with you. Make sure you work a co-curricular policy and tie it with COVID because there are a number of things that we'll have to do differently. So you need a policy to help to guide the leaders who are, who are, who are leading the clubs. And the students must know about the policy so as to better prepare them for what is coming. I am suggesting that you meet virtually as much as possible. Clubs and societies that you normally have on the inside, I'm suggesting that you have remote meetings um, to facilitate these clubs and to ensure that these clubs continue to happen. Because based on the number of students that are in these clubs, to meet in a group, in a room with 20 and 25 and 30 students, that won't cut it when we resume school in September. So virtual meetings, will be the way forward. For the external activities that you normally have on the outside, on the courts, on the field of play and so on, such as football, track and field, basketball, I'm suggesting that we meet in small groups for a short period of time. And it all depends on how you schedule and the space that you have to work with. Additionally, you can have blended meeting because some students may not have the gadgets to meet on the virtual front. Additionally, I'm asking you to continue the timetable for clubs and societies. It's important that as you timetable, the rooms are properly prepared, sanitized, and the markings are all there so that the students who are part of these clubs can observe the necessary protocols. And lastly, I want to leave a word of encouragement with my colleagues. We are the Joshua's of the classrooms. We are the Joshua's in our schools. We are the Davids. We have the sling and the sling of faith. COVID-19 is Goliath. And we are gonna slay the Goliath. We're gonna pull together, we're gonna encourage each other. And at the end of the day, Joshua must win. At the end of the day, David must win because we're gonna slay the giant and the giant called COVID-19. God bless you and be strong and be encouraged.